We've got two great woodworking ideas for you today. We're going to put together a book stand, quite simply, and then a small box with a drawer. And both are going to look very unique, a little different, and most importantly, they're going to be handmade. The book stand itself doesn't take too many parts, just some detail work. There'll be a large back to brace the book and some support feet. And then from there, we'll need a small platform and a lip, as well as two dowels evenly spaced from the center to hold that book open. To hold whichever book you're reading open. And maybe it's a book on woodworking, studying some of the techniques we're seeing here. All the grooves we're cutting and carving out, chiseling away, are so that we don't have to use nails and screws. A little bit of glue and an excellent fit. There you can see the base of the body and then another one of our grooves for a perfect fit. And one of our favorite books sits just fine. On to our next awesome craft. This time around, we're going to make a very unique little drawer in the shape of a box. It's going to stand on some legs that we're actually just going to fashion out of nails by hammering them to a desired depth. And we're going to use the same nails around the rest of the box. They'll be our finishing details. But first things first, we've got to cut out and carve the grooves to connect the six pieces we need to construct our box. There's the top, bottom, and sides. But now we need a backing, and we also need a drawer. We even spray painted our nails for continuity, giving them all that same look. And the black will look really nice against the natural wood grains. Almost there now, just some fine tuning and cutting the last few pieces into shape before we chisel out those grooves and put this puzzle together. The drawer is complete. A few test pieces inside. You've got to have something in your drawer. And we've even treated the wood with some lovely cutting board oil. And look at that finish. A smart, cute, and very unique drawer. If you decide to take these projects on, we'd love to see the end result. Drop those pictures in the comments section. Otherwise, give this video a like or a share.